Thank you, and I'd like to invite General Milley. Thank you, Secretary, for those uh, uh, words, and thank you, Mr. President, for your leadership. And I want to publicly thank uh, Admiral Craig Fowler, the commander of uh, U.S. Southern Command out of Miami, uh, for leading this operation, which is underway effective uh, today. And also Admiral Gilday, uh, the Chief of Naval Operations, Admiral Schultz, for their contributions to this from their services. There's thousands of sailors, uh, Coast Guardsmen, uh, soldiers, airmen, Marines involved in this operation. Uh, we came upon some intelligence uh, some time ago uh, that the drug cartels, as a result of COVID-19, were going to try to take advantage uh, of the situation and try to infiltrate additional drugs into our country. As we know, the 70,000 Americans uh, die on an average annual basis uh, to drugs. Uh, that's unacceptable. We're at war with COVID-19, we're at war with terrorists, and we are at war with the drug cartels as well. Uh, this is the United States military. You will not penetrate this country. You will not get past Jump Street. You're not going to come in here and kill additional Americans. And we will marshal whatever assets are required to prevent your entry into this country to kill Americans. So right now the Navy has marshaled additional Gray Hall ships from both PACOM and UCOM and for the Naval Fleet at Norfolk. And they are set sail already and they are in the Caribbean right now. In addition to that, there's 10 Coast Guard cutters and there's Special Operations Forces and Security Force Assistance Brigades along with Air Force uh, reconnaissance aircraft. The bottom line is you're not going to get through. Uh, now is not the time to try to penetrate the United States with illegal drugs to kill Americans. Uh, with the United States military, we will defend our country regardless of the cost. Thank you, Mr. President. Thank, Thank you, you, Secretary. Much, Thank, you. Nope. Thank you, Mr. President. Thanks for your uh, decisive leadership as we confront this unprecedented uh, challenge uh, posed by corona coronavirus. And I'd like to thank you for your support for this important initiative and thank